Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to get free subdomains for your Minecraft servers. Well, there are three types, well, actually, two types, but in the first way, there are two types. So let's keep going. So, the first thing is this. So, let me get back with the IP import. Okay, so I'm here with my Bungie card server. I have a Bungie card network, but no one plays it. I'll put, that, I'll put the IP in the description. So, I'm going to show you another way of so getting a subdomain so let's just go so copy this actually for first you just copy the IP from here copy the IP from there so you can just type in your email I'm just gonna put some random email doesn't really matter just put server IP and then port so what's my port this is my port I just put it here and make sure to choose minecraft the pocket edition is like you know for pocket edition servers minecraft is for normal so I'm just gonna make it YouTube as well. Now just put what do you say MC pocket or pocket server? Anything is okay. Just put this. Okay. And just create. And then it registers so no one else can choose the same domain. Even though they choose it doesn't work. So here just copy this. So let's see. Did I copy? So let's copy this. I'm gonna show you if it's actually gonna work. So this is website called Minecraft Status. I'm gonna show you. Well, I got a bad laptop, so I can't actually show it by joining the server. But I'll show you from here. So here, Minecraft Status. Okay, so here we go. Wait for it. It's actually a subdomain creator. I'll leave the link in the description. Don't worry about that. So, yeah, it's here. So, just type in here. Like, if you are server is bedrock server, make sure to take it. So, remove the dot if you have copied it. Let's get server status. Okay. Let me see, it's loading. No idea why it's taking so long. Here it is. See? It worked. Aircraft network. No one is actually playing because I didn't actually advertise it. But it'd be cool if one of you guys actually play. So that's all. I'm gonna leave that in the description. Next one's Alexa subdomain. Well, actually, I'm gonna use Alexa Nerd. Its services are so cheap that you can't even explain. Like, I'm gonna show you. It's just cheap. It's zero point seven five dollars, which is like legit. Wait for it. Yeah, so here, okay, they increased it, but you know, it's still affordable. And you can get a good, get a good node, good CPU, it's just good. Just, you can just order one. And leave that in the description, obviously. Okay, so let's start. I'm gonna choose this because it's just identical. Because the other ones, they're gonna make it look big. But they know that you're using it, it's up to me. So I'm just gonna type. Uh, prefix, yeah, the prefix YouTube is pop. So, you know, IP. This is the IP we had. Uh, I think it's this one. Let me check. Yeah, 25625. Yeah, that. And obviously, I am not robot. Who else is making video then? Huh? Yeah, wait, what is this? Let me try it again. If it doesn't work, yeah, create. Yes, don't worry, I'm gonna even test this. Content for subdomain uh, must be valid. Okay, are you sure if it's is it wrong or something? Let's just type in back. YouTube is wrong. Let me just type it small. YouTube is wrong. I'm just gonna try it with the other domain. Probably just try it. Because maybe I have. Create. So it's created, nice. Probably was a subdomain problem. So just try it here. Hopefully it works. So okay. Let's 
actually worked. These two are very great because they are actually damn identical and no one's gonna even, you know, make fun of you for using these two mains. So it's actually good to use these. And you know, I'm gonna close this now. The next thing is Phenom. I'm gonna show you that. <coughs> Sorry. I'm gonna keep that up for now. I'm gonna make sure to subscribe for more content. Okay. So let me skip ahead till I get a domain. Okay, so here let's find a new domain. Just go on YouTube, this park, whatever. No, it's just cool. Let's check availability. Might be a bit late. Yeah, here it is. The best domains are suggested CF or TK because they're the most attractive. But they might judge you with the TK domain, so you might. You might want to choose CF. Okay, so check out. No. Make sure to choose it 12 months because if you're planning for long term Minecraft server, it's good. So it's here. But you can do this later, so don't touch them. Okay. So here we go. So I have read and agreed to terms and conditions, which I don't know where they are. So let's go. Go to verify you know, each try again. Wait, yeah, sure. It's done. So let's just go to my domains and manage domain. And then just go to name servers. So you know just go to the next page, just create a new page. You might want to create a Cloudflare account. So cloudflare.com. I'm just gonna log in with my existing account. So log in. It's just nice how we can just use three domains. So here, you could always sign up. I'm gonna put the link, links, like all the links needed in the description, so don't worry. Mm -hmm. just, you're gonna add a site. It might be different for you because it's the first time. You know, you might find it like this, but still, you know, copy paste domain, type it here, and you know, just type the domain. Okay, let me just check. No, okay, I don't. I'll just continue. Wait, type OK again. Well, it takes approximately 5 minutes. But it's actually faster than you know. So, yeah, let's. I'll be back when the do once. Well, uh, it seems to me I have a problem because I have too many sites. So, I'm just going to show you with my existing site. Okay, so I'm not actually using the. Wait. Yeah, I'm not actually using this domain for now. I'm going to show you what uh, name servers to add. You know, custom name servers. Go down. Just copy this. This is the first one. Copy. And put it here. And then let's copy this. Like name server 1, name server 2. And then let's change name server. So now it's going to totally be controlled by Cloudflare. So you can't use this manage screen on DNS. So you might you don't have anything to do with this just so just close it and here it is I'm gonna show you I'm gonna delete the old records you know, to explain it to you okay so let's delete this I'm gonna show you completely so here's my domain right so copy that so you might want to create okay, just delete this for now so add record it's a it make sure it's a not a, a, a so name it's just like if you want to keep it mc.blazelands.dk or if you want just normal just put it at so i'm gonna just keep it at and then put the ip and make sure the proxy is disabled because you don't want it to be enabled or it's not gonna work okay so just add another icon and make sure it's srv for now so it's srv okay no it's srv here 
Oh. Ah, this is this bit. Let me check. Wait, I might have done something. Let me check. No, it's correct. I think it's here. You that one just type your the same exact thing as a domain. Don't use anything else. So here it is. MC dot blazeland strategy or play dot m blazeland strategy or stuff. And here make sure it's Minecraft. Okay. And here just put the it's just zero. Zero and four four four. Yeah, this and target is blazelands dot tk because you're targeting it to this like if you already have like now mind that i'll tell you later but you know, now let's check this so your new domain is play dot blazelands dot tk let's see hopefully it works as you see it actually work here so you know finally everything is going to be in description so don't worry no. and make sure to like this uh, video if you like it because i never really made these videos and i hope people enjoy it and sorry for the bad quality and voice i'm just new to this thing so thank you